I don't know what this is. Are we still friends? I don't know about you, but have you ever felt this pressure? Like, man, we were like really, really close in college, but we haven't talked in a really long time. Should I have expectations? Are we still friends or nah? It's not like it was. So what is it? The single most important key to making lifelong friends, guaranteed. What's up y'all, it's your girl KB. So a lot of people wonder, what is the key to making lifelong friends? Because they want them. As we go through life, school, jobs, ministries, whatever, we make great life-giving connections. But most of them don't often transition with us into our new seasons, which in some ways makes sense. But in other ways, it's kind of sad and unfortunate and I don't think it has to be this way. It would be incredibly dope if we could make connections with people and then go our separate ways. But when we were able to reconnect in whatever season, we were able to pick up right where we left off. But the question is, how do you do that? Friendship tears. When you only have two major categories of your friendships, your BFFs and then acquaintances, you're limiting how you get to enjoy people in different seasons of life. If you understand friendship tiers, there are five, then your relationships can flow within the tiers any given season. And you don't then have to question, are we still friends? You will have clarity for what the relationship is. You will know what aspects the friendship creates connection on and you won't feel the pressure to be something that you're not when you catch up. I want you to remember it's not a hard conversation, it's a heart conversation. Love y'all.